back to my channel or welcome in whatever I have got some more of my Christmas craft goods that I brought in through my my garage which is my craft hut but anyway I've got some of this beautiful ribbon ho 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 it's about three quarters of an inch thick when I go on holiday I buy these when I'm away on holiday but rather than shipping them in your case like that which takes up a lot of room there's a lot of wasted space in there I always take them off the spool and that way I can shove them inside a shoe or a wee tiny space wherever I've got one that's some beautiful red ribbon with some gold snowflakes and some that candy cane ribbon is just stunning it's really shiny I love that so I'll put my ribbons in there and as I showed you a wee minute ago, I've got some of the gold. I had the red one, I showed you the red one the other day. And that's the gold ones. That must be a pound shop one, I think. So, I have them. I have loads of these wee, you know, Tis the Season, Merry and Bright, Peace. These sorts of things, Jingle Bells, Noel, Let It Snow. I've got a load of them and I've got great big huge tubs of gesso and snow text out my hut. But I've got loads and loads and loads of these plastic tubs as well. So I have put some gesso in a tub and I love this snow text stuff. See if I can show you. See the texture of it? It's like sand. Now you can make your own, but I've had this for a long time. And I must say, it stayed moist. I mean, that'll maybe be five years after that, and it's still moist. But I look after them. Uh, I've got other wee wooden things here. Like deer heads, Santa hats, a, wee, a Santa shape. Some of these are good, but some of them I just don't use. You can, it's just, you've got to find the right project for them, I think. Happy shopping for anybody that's heading out to the SECC this weekend. Look at these baubles, these pom-poms. These pom-poms are beautiful. They're two centimetre iridescent snowballs. I don't know if you can see them. See it all shiny and sparkly there. Yes, it's the SECC Craft Fair. I've not went for a few years since they stopped parking just outside the event. And if you've got to get away over to the multi-story car park, I don't go anymore. And anyway, I find that the online prices are much better than the craft fair prices. And there I have got, that's about quarter inch. And it's a Santa belt ribbon. If you can see that there. And I've got two of these. As I say, I don't mind these unwrapping because I wrap them back up. And I just use them as I need them. These Santa belt ribbons, they're quite good for going round cards. So they are. Anyway, I have to wrap it up. I can't just... It's getting quite dark in here now. And the clocks go back tomorrow night. So it'll be dark soon, the back of four o'clock. So that's two of them. I brought in my white Versa mat pad, ink pad. I've got some beautiful red twine. I love that twine. Where did I buy that now? I can't remember if it was Michael's or the Dollar Street. But you get it here. You get it in all sorts of places. And it's handy for Christmas. Shh, shh, enough. Platinum ink pad as well. The brilliant ink pad. Storm. I've got some dress it up holiday buttons. As you can see, they're tiny wee trees. Mittens, stockings, we Santas, we snowmen. I've got a couple of packs of these kind of button things. There's another one there. It's got the blue gloves, um, the carrot nose, and it's got the hat and the snowflakes. And last year I bought one of these 
packs and I done a, 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 a made a snow dome and I put water and iridescent glitter in it and some of the wee polystyrene snowflakes and I put a set of this in, I put the mittens, the carrot nose, the top hat and a snowflake and I'm it wasn't the day buttons I used, it was wee tiny buttons. I've got loads of wee tiny buttons. And I done it as a build your own snowman. So that's an idea for them. I brought them in. I've got some reindeer ribbon. Most of the ribbon that I'm showing you I bought from, it was probably Michael's, but in Michael's they have dollar bins. This here is two inch wide and it's hessian and red glitter and I think I'm going to be using that for my first project I was up most of the night last night can't sleep again so I was down here crafting a wee bit I brought in these, I brought in my stickles the, what colour is that? I don't think it tells you, it's just red it's a Hampton art anyway. Studio G and I've got the pearl effects buttons. Obviously they'll be used for likes of uh, holly berries, that kind of thing. On projects and I've brought in my Studio G, just the, the iridescent one. Doo -doo -doo. I have brought in a bag of charms. Got hundreds of these charms. I've got loads and loads and loads of Christmas trees and I've got snowmen, snowflakes, rocking horses, mittens, all sorts of things, all different ones. There's even a wee tiny Santa. I think there's a hundred. Oh, there's wee candy canes as well. Tiny wee candy canes. They're not that tiny, they're a decent size. So, we'll see what we can do with them. Put that in a box in a wee second. I have these. I bought these last year and I'm quite sure I've done a haul and you've seen me hauling these. I've got these. I've got elves. I've got Santas. And I think I've got snowmen as well. But I think I used some of them at school last year. And I bought these fabric stickers. They're two different sizes and it's obviously, as you can see, it's just Santa's belt. I haven't found a purpose for them yet, but I will find something to make with them for this year. And I've got a wee bag of stickers here, stockings and snowflakes. The stickers all go in there. Last year I bought these in the range and I'm sure I gifted some of these to some people. These are the open Christmas tree, as you can see there. It's quite open and they one are just pine solid ones. I've got my snowflake brads which are recollection and I'll put all of these into my box, into my Christmas box and I've got these. I bought these a couple of years ago when I was on holiday and I haven't found a purpose for them. I bought two bags of each and I took a bag into the school and made pencil gift sets and I put some of these because they're wee erasers and they are quite small so we could only sell them up the top end of the school and obviously I made warning labels to go on them to say it was a tiny wee thing, blah blah, watch your children don't swallow it. But it's amazing what you've got to put on things nowadays. I don't think people have got common sense sometimes. Look, see, it's a wee tiny penguin eraser. And I think there's about 100 in there. What does it say? 60. 60 there is. So I've got penguins. And I've got snowmen. Christmas trees. There's a wee tiny snowmen. See them? Christmas trees, there's two different colours. Yeah, that's them. Oh, there's another wee bag of buttons. That's just Santa's glasses and snowflakes and presents. Mitts, a hat, 
the naughty list that you sent to face. And these I bought, I bought loads of these. I was going to make a scene in my fairy tree. So I don't know why this is here. It's these bottle brushes. And I bought a load of stuff to do my fairy gardens and my flower pots. I did do some this year. And I've got the berries. That's the Christmas berries, that's why it's there. The wee stamens for putting in the centre of your flowers and things. And I have these. These are larger rubbers. I had loads and loads of these. I think I've got about a pack each in here. But I had three or four packs that they're all used. I have the brown Christmas tree. They're all kind of covered in glitter and stuff. A wee snowman. A wee red snowman. A wee green reindeer. And a wee white snowman. And obviously they're pencil toppers. They're good for making up wee gift sets and things. Oh. Right, so that's some more of my Christmas goodies. I was going to show you my dies as well, but I would be here forever in my fortnight trying to show you the dies. Last night I couldn't sleep. Let me see if I can put that wee light on. Is that any better? Not much, but we'll see. Last night I couldn't sleep, so I come down the stairs and I cut some of these and I was playing away. This is a... What die is this again? There it is. I think it's a Sweet Dixie. Yep, it's a Sweet Dixie die. Sweet Dixie Gingerbread Man. Actually, I better put the Gingerbread Man back in. And you get the Gingerbread Man, a scarf, his hat, uh, a bow tie, a walking stick, or the candy cane, and the holly berries as well. So, I cut out quite a few. This one, I just stuck white pom-poms on the front of them today. That's a wee gingerbread man. And there's the wee gingerbread man. Now, some of these, they're different. Because that one there... Well, it's no much better, is it? There, I'll take it off. That one there, I don't know if I'll be able to show you. I actually cut the icing strips from the same card as I've used on his hat. He's lost a wee eye. Where it's there. And I glued them back on and I quite like that effect. But oh, it's quite footery. It's really quite footery. So those ones there, they are done with the white glitter pen. And to be honest, they're no really any different. Bit for him and his wee squinty eye. I need to get that sorted. Some of them have put bow ties on. Some of them have put um, scarf on. As you can see there. And this one he's just got his three wee buttons on. But I've got the candy canes, so he could be holding a candy cane. I'll maybe put a bow tie on him. I'll see. I said I've got loads of wee extras cut just to go on them. So my first project, I'm going to use them. I've made the embellishments, so I'll make something with them. And it'll just be a wee surprise. Okay. Well, thanks for watching some of the things that I use for my Christmas crafting. Uh, if you would like to see anything in particular, if you have in mind any makes in particular that you would like to see, give me a shout, because if I can help you, I certainly will. If... If you just want to chat, leave me a comment and I'll get back to you as well. And so, I come to the end. So for, for today, I'll say bye. And hopefully I'll see you all again the next time. Bye.